Okay, in this video I'm going to do one more example of factoring perfect square trinomials. And I'm going to factor this expression 2p plus t squared plus 6 times 2p plus t plus 9. And I think at first this is one of those that looks a little confusing if you, you know, you ran into it. Uh, you might be inclined to try to multiply everything out, collect any like terms, and uh, to me then you'd have a big old mess and you'd be trying to factor that. Um, maybe it would work, but uh, I think the thing that we need to recognize here again is really this is a perfect square trinomial. Okay, and I'm going to try to rewrite it in this, you know, in this form just to illustrate it, um, just to really emphasize that. So notice, okay, uh, 2p plus t squared, there that is. Uh, we have 6, so I'm going to leave it as 6. The only thing I'm really going to do here at the first step is rewrite my 9 as, well, I can rewrite that as positive 3 squared. And it says in this formula, it says this would be our a value. So a would equal 2p plus t. That's what's being squared. b would have the value of 3. And notice it says in the middle we take 2 times a which is 2p plus t, times b, which is 3. Notice if you multiply all those together, 2 times 3 is 6, and then we'll get our 2p plus t. We do get this middle term back. So to me, it says we do have this form, a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. So it says, well, we can simply factor that now. It says we take a which is 2p plus t, and it says we add to that b, which is positive 3, and then it says we just rewrite it again. It's a perfect square. Okay, and in this case you could drop the parentheses on the inside, 2p plus t plus 3. Again, you could think about there as being a coefficient of positive 1, so if you multiply it out it just gets rid of it. And then we have 2p plus t plus 3, or again even we could rewrite this as 2p plus t plus 3, since we have 1 and 2 of them being multiplied, we could rewrite that as that whole quantity squared. So again, you know, it looks a little tricky at the beginning, but uh, just trying to really emphasize this form, this a squared plus 2ab plus b squared, hey that's a perfect square trinomial. Um, and it actually turns out it factors a little bit, a little bit uh, more nicely than I think uh, you might first believe.